It's great living on a ship. Um, they're kind of like small little villages, really. Um, they've got everything you need to survive. They've got water purification, there's a canteen, the science labs, there's the computer rooms, there's the bridge which you can go up and look out to see. Everything's heated, so that's all the outside decks. All the handrails are all heated as well to stop them freezing. You've got a sauna, you've got a nice coffee lounge, and it really is about the social interactions and it really is shipmates. There is that feeling of living and working together. So you need to find your way to work with everybody and appreciate everybody because you rely on each other. Some of the hardest things are being away from family and friends as we can be away for up to two and a half, three months at a time. Communication is incredible. When I first came you, you wrote a letter, now you just pick up the phone. The job itself can be taxing. Maybe we've had a lot of rough weather, so not a lot of sleep and people are a bit groggy. For me, the biggest challenge is uh, sleeping, especially in rough weather. <laughs> Ice breaking uh, is noisy, it can throw you out of bed. We do come complete with our own doctor's surgery and the ship always carries a doctor whilst in polar regions. You have your places where you can calm down after a hard day of work. Most important is, of course, your own cabin. On the new Sir David Edinburgh, we will have cabins for two or a single person, and all of them will have windows to the outside, which will make a huge difference to be able to look out. I might turn around and see nothing one day, but the next day I'll see a dolphin or a sunfish or, or just something that, you know, actually is a pretty unique view. I was left outside and a minke whale came up right next to the ship to have a little rest and a breathe because we'd made a hole in the ice. I was screaming and shouting, is there anybody else to see this? And there wasn't. It just feels like something that is a real privilege. <laughs>